Hey guys, what's up, Cody here, and welcome back to another episode of uh, I'm gonna go tell uh, Kenny that I killed someone. Uh, and Clementine, I told her, and that's it. <laughs> I only told him and Hi, her. Well, I'm about to tell him, and I already told. Yeah, so just these two. These are the only two I really trust: Clementine and um, Kenny. I'm Kenny, not gonna tell Kasha. So She's gonna get I scared. Tell you something. Yeah. What do you got? There's no way I was I was gonna tell her. Even Kenny's gonna tell me not to tell her. It's serious. Okay, should I sit down? <laughs> Come on. I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's, different from everything. This was before the walkers. A citizen? Yes. I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and you know, I, I was worried. Look, we've all done gnarly shit now. But what? You were some kind of killer? It's not like that. Is Duck safe around you? Of course. Good. But you should know, if we gotta make numbers when it comes to a- Fuck this. <laughs> I'm not gonna let him take that shit. I'm sorry, guys. I know I keep promising I'm not gonna, like, go back on my decisions, but... God damn it, I love Kenny so much. Okay, well, I just finished talking to Clem, and I'm not gonna go tell Kenny, and I'm sure so I'm not gonna tell Katja. Because I know if you do tell Kenny, he does tell you not to tell Katja at the very least, but, um, I'm not even gonna bother talking to Ben because his dialogue had nothing to do with anything, and I already did it, so it doesn't matter. And, hey, what the hell is this? Yeah, don't look at it. It's obviously here for a reason, but okay. The reason why I say that is because that is actually more important than I... The game made it seem like just there, but okay. Whatever. The hell? It's all fucking boarded. They don't want me to go that way, I assume. Alright. Broken glass! There's some broken glass on the ground there. Right, right, you, you. There's no way I'm telling Lily. There's really no one I can trust besides Clem, really. Well then. There's some broken glass on the ground there. Okay. That was as useless as it. Whatever. Can we do anything here? Well, what the frickin' flippity flip? Here, I'll just tell them about the flashlight. Actually. Man, there's no one that knows nothing about the flashlight. Well, I'm not telling Lily about this thing. Yeah, whatever. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up. Oh, now they want me to go check that That's shit out. <sighs> there better be something else there now. There, now it lets me do something. That's gay. I had to talk to them first. It's a broken glass. Doc. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Duck is weird. 
Well, Clementine already said it wasn't her, but we're gonna go ask her about the pink truck. But actually, let me talk to Ben first, and you'll see why. Hey, Ben, I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my, well, my thoughts, and I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. <laughs> well... I didn't think Ben would react that way, considering factors of the remaining events in this episode hey, that I will time. not spoil. Hey, do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You want blue? No, yes. Okay. Fuck. Hey. Pink was my favorite color. Shit. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was totally, to bro. Yeah, duck. I got it. Good job. Not that so hard if it was fucking duck. <laughs> Dude, duck thinks you are incredibly awesome. <laughs> Let's get a pose together. Fucking G. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Well, Lily neither. Mm, I wonder why. That's probably for the best. <laughs> Fucking Duck, I love this kid. You seem to know a bit about all of this. The chalk, you found the scuff here. This is gonna sound crazy, but... You're not involved, are you? No, I'm a good guy. Have you found anything else? Just the chalk. I also found some bugs underneath <laughs> the stairs. Don't tell Clementine. Uh, I love this okay, quarrel between him and Clementine. <laughs> Stay inside so the cute. I will, I will. More chalk. Yeah, see, it's more important than you think. You didn't want to inspect it earlier. Oh, come on, he still doesn't want to inspect it? What a dick. More chalk. Alright, now he's going to inspect it just because it's pink chalk, right? Mm. Somebody was over here, too. See, Crack cocaine. Did good, huh? You did great. Yeah, duck, you did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. <laughs> He's like, okay. And then he gets back to superhero mode. Superhero duck. Hey, super duck. <laughs> super duck. His name is Duck. <laughs> shimmy, shimmy. I did the shimmy. Yo. Look, look at them. Look at them right there. You see that? Oh. Those bandits gave us hell. They've been quiet for days now. And you'll know why, too. Oh, it's probably nothing. All right, let's go back. <laughs> no. There's a grate down there. Yeah, fucking do. <sighs> it's a bag of poop. And there's a lighter. Light it on fire. Oh, it's nothing. All right, let's go. <laughs> That'd be a complete... Asshole if I didn't God Son of a bitch. Well That's it for now <laughs> How's that cliffhanger? <laughs>